Bevan here of Red Carpet New Zealand backstage at the Sky City Theatre for the variety show This Is Who We Are. Now all the talents and performers here tonight are giving up their time 100% for free and 100% of the proceeds go directly to those affected by the Christchurch attack that happened only two weeks ago. So join us where we get to speak to those performers here tonight. How are you feeling about being here with all the other performers? I'm feeling pretty inspired just by the group of people that are performing tonight. It's just amazing to be, you know, considered to be um, part of the part of this team of people volunteering for this. And I just feel so impressed and it's just incredible what everyone's pulled together, you know, all volunteering their time. I just think it's amazing and it's humbling and inspiring at the same time. Any words out there to Aotearoa about this evening and what they can expect in totality? Yeah, make sure that you get out there and support our Muslim community, brothers and sisters, love each other, and always make sure that you do everything with love in your heart. The song that we will be singing is called I'll Be Fine, and it's called, you know, through darkness there's light, and through darkness we'll survive, you know what I mean? And it's all about just that love. Through love, we'll win, you know what I mean? And there's always going to be hate. No matter wherever you go in life, it's always going to continue, but love always wins. And if we can spread that message and if we can get that around and we can get everyone to be open-minded to everyone else's differences, we will prosper. I think what's been beautiful, I live overseas now, and being able to see the New Zealand response and you know, being able to see that the response is so Kiwi. I hope that the audience is uplifted by, by that outpouring of love from the performers and everyone that's been involved in the production. And also I think it just unifies us with a oneness as New Zealanders and also for humanity, you know, without sounding too cheesy. But, but that, that's what it is, you know, drawing us together rather than making, you know, divides. Yeah. Oh, I just think it's a great celebration of who we really are. I mean, you know, we, we know what we're not after the horrific events, but I think now it's a time that we, we have shown the world that we've come together. Uh, we have a diverse community. We've got these people who are performing here tonight um, with all different skills and all different backgrounds. I mean, one of the most beloved New Zealanders we have is an import from the UK. I mean, Suzanne Paul. So, you know, <laughs> she was invited along, and so we've got to celebrate that, and I think it's a huge honour to be involved, so I'm just, I'm stoked and I'm very lucky. I mean, we all got friends from all walks of life, and I think it's really sad that this one single incident has kind of almost redefined our country to some degree uh, and made us all be a little bit on ease, but let's hope that that doesn't last for too long and we get back to how we all were and hope it's brought us all closer together. Yeah. Tonight, Ali, what do you hope audiences to walk away with after having experienced this evening? The conversation to continue to um, talk about hope and peace and love and equality and accepting one another for all our differences. Come on, man, we all have a heart, a liver, a kidneys. We are all the same. It does my head in. It is so frustrating, which is why I wrote my song, Release Our Love, which I sang tonight, because I just think it's, it's just ridiculous. And we've got children and their children, and so they need to, we need to stop the cycle of, of hatred. So I think that the lasting impact for people is going to be, and for me, it's just the same as anybody else, that it's just another thing that will, if you let it, stress you out a bit more, make you feel a bit helpless in the face of it, and then you continue to ask the questions, why here? Why this place? Why did all of these things? We've had earthquakes, floods, fires, and now this terrible event in our community, you know. And all I can say is, people haven't run away, it's made us all stronger, I hope a better community. What happened was so sad and so tragic, but this is there's a silver lining, and this coming together with creativity and music and love is uh, is wonderful. Bex, why is tonight so important? Oh, so many reasons. It's such a great cause. We want to all kind of pull together, and music is such a great way to do that. Sorry, Harry looks like he wants to say something. What do you think, Harry? What do you reckon, dude? Yeah. No, fair enough. Captures everything right there. So we're here with Jared Fell, who's just done a performance out there. Jared, how was it? Yeah, it was fun. It was uh, there's a few little tech things, but it was, I had a lot of fun. Um, we got to punk one of the judges, Jason, um, which wasn't set up. So uh, the director was like, oh, can you go pickpocket one of the MCs? So I was like, yeah, why not? We're going to do a big thing. So New Zealand, stay strong. That's my little message there. Yeah. It's one of the most amazing feelings to be able to help New Zealand. Yeah. Yeah, thanks for having me.
Thank you yeah. for doing what you do. No and uh, I'll show you some more magic in the bathroom. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> the world at the moment seems to be about sort of hatred and division, and I think it's all about love, kindness, and connection. And as terrible as it was, the atrocities that happened on March the 15th, it's created a, out of tragedy, has come some triumph because everyone in New Zealand and the world are going, no, we don't want this. This is not who we are. If you can give a little or give a lot, then please give because there are some people who have gone through some things I think, you know, the average person amongst us couldn't even begin to fathom. So if you could give whatever, I know it'll go to a great place. So thank you for watching and thank you for doing what you do in New Zealand. Thanks New Zealand for Thanks watching so and uh, please give as much as you can. Oh, yeah.